Sunbelt kickoff Tuesday offering Louisiana Lafayette. The Ragin' Cajuns taking on Arkansas State. Here's Laura Rutledge with the pregame report. Expect to see some trick plays from Arkansas State tonight. Head coach Blake Anderson has shown he's not afraid to use them with a fake punt against Tennessee and a fake punt in the fainting goat form against Miami that didn't quite go as planned. I'd say that didn't quite go go as planned as well. Let's flash back to September 13th. Arkansas State running the fake punt against Miami. It's intercepted. Didn't work. Take another few looks here closely at Booker Mays who folds his arms and pretends to faint. The Red Wolves up to their old tricks again on Tuesday. Fourth and two lining up in punt formation. Four receivers wide. Send a fifth in motion. It's Rocky Hayes catching the snap running left for the first down. 25 seconds left in the half, down 11. They fake out the Raging Cajuns and the cameraman as well. Michael Gordon picking up the first down. Take another look. It's the, the old fumble Ruski. This is with their backs to their own end zone. Third quarter, backed up to their end zone again. Fourth and 11, Chris Stone faking the direct snap. Throws to Luke Ferguson. This didn't work out as well. Louisiana Lafayette gets the ball at the six-yard line. Enough with the shenanigans. Ensuing rage and Cajun touch. It's a second and goal. Alonzo Harris, who went for over 100 on the ground, had one of his four touchdowns right there. How about the tandem of Harris and Elijah McGuire? Fourth quarter, rage and Cajuns looking to seal this game. It's McGuire that takes the handoff and takes off. 54 yards later, he's in the end zone. He ran for 265 and four scores as well. The running backs combined for eight touchdowns, each team over 500 yards of offense. Louisiana Lafayette, 55 to 40.